the Komodo building is rather secure. Well, we've got this outdoor exhibit with one of our big pythons in it. And since our neighbors don't want a python roaming in their neighborhood, apparently, uh, we're going to go ahead and catch this snake up and put it in a bag and put it in this container and uh, then put that inside the Komodo building. So everything's nice and secure. This is a lot of snake, and though she's not venomous, uh, they are dangerous animals. So this team has got to work together to grab her head, which she, of course, is not going to enjoy, but this is part of dealing with the storm. And she'll forgive us later when we give her a nice big food item. Jim is our curator of reptiles in the blue shirt. He's been with us 30 years, so this is not his first time wrangling a big python but we take it seriously every time. I know you see other people on YouTube being very cavalier with these snakes, uh, but we, uh, we'd rather just everybody goes home and rides out the storm with their families than has to deal with a severe python bite. And one of these bites can be very severe. Even with Jim having the snake, Somebody does not want to back into that mouth. It's still capable of biting. He has to direct it away from the other keepers. We've got a whole group of people trying to get a snake in a bag. And Jim's not strangling the snake. Uh, he's just keeping it from turning around and biting somebody. The two keepers in the back are <laughs> quickly shoving the back of the snake into a bag as these two keepers up front are trying to keep it from <laughs> working its way back out. Snake then goes into a hard container and then goes into the secure building. The neighborhood is safe. Of course this doesn't bother the snake. I mean getting grabbed to begin with probably irritated her but being put in a bag is actually a nice quiet dark space. And that's a space that a snake would find during a storm anyway. So none of this is bothering the snake now. It'll be fine. This will make the neighbors feel safe now. Love you.